Hi friends, I am Mrs. Vashav. Today I want to share a soup recipe with all of you. This is very very simple soup which I make it regularly and anybody can make in a very simple way like home style I am going to show you. This simple soup that is tomato soup. Maybe you all know how to make this tomato soup but still I want to share my recipe which I make it regularly at my house. So let's start this simple tomato soup. I am not using too much of ingredients today just the home style I am making. So I am using little bit of garlic and one onion and just three four tomatoes. So here in a pan first we are going to add some you know either you can use olive oil or you know butter or oil anything if you home style you know you can just use either oil also just add some butter and we are going to add some garlic in it let this little bit saute and then we are going to add some bay leaf and some peppercorns and some one onion you know you need not chop it you can just add it directly and just three tomatoes this also you need not remove the skin you need not you know finely chopped just cut into little bit big cubes that's it and this we are going to just saute it for two to three minutes and then we are going to add good amount of water and we are going to boil it once this is nicely boiled then we are going to grind it into a nice smooth paste in this you can just add some salt also very little later on we will check the seasoning and then again we can add the salt so just mix it and we'll cook for two minutes then we are going to add water so dear friends here after two minutes of nicely sauteing we are going to add water you know you can just add some two to three cups of water and we are going to simmer this for at least five minutes then we are going to switch off the flame and grind it so we are going to wait for five minutes so dear friends after five minutes of you know nicely it has been simmered and nicely boiled so now i'm going to switch off the flame and you know just let it slightly cool down and then we are going to nicely make it into a fine paste but before making into a paste just remove this bay leaf and we are going to grind this now so dear friends once you know this is slightly cooled down i made it into a nice fine paste you know you can just remove little bit of water and only first you grind the ingredients then if you need water you can just add some water and you can make it into a nice fine paste and this we are going to now you know again we are going to simmer it for another three to five minutes then our awesome soup tomato soup will be ready so in the same pan just add very little of butter again or usually what i do is when i sorted this onion garlic and tomato at that time little bit for thickening what i do is i add little bit of all purpose flour so you can just add one teaspoon of all purpose flour in the starting itself so that you know this process you can just skip it just add teaspoon of all purpose flour and we are going to mix this nicely just for little bit of thickening we are just going to add the butter and this all purpose flour that's it just for a minute we are going to cook it then we are going to add little bit of water not milk or anything just little bit of water so that you know it won't form any lumps very slowly see that this won't form any lumps or you can just directly strain this into you know this mixture but you know if you do it directly it may form lumps so to avoid lumps first i'm adding little bit of water see this is nice and this mixture is ready now for little bit thickening see and now we are going to strain this tomato mixture just take a strainer and strain it like this for tomato color you know you can just add little bit of red color if you want but we are making a home style tomato soup so i don't want to add any colors into this so just strain it out and let it boil for three minutes then we can have this hot hot soup before this gets simmered so we are going to just check the taste first so just take little wow i think i can add little bit of you know salt always for soups you know you reduce the salt you know we are going to have only the soup so if it is more salt we cannot have it so always reduce the salt and in this in the last we are going to add little bit of herbs mixed herbs if you want you can add it or if you don't want you can just skip it so just add very little to give little bit of that herbs flavor that's it you can see this is little bit thick 
once this will simmer for another two minutes or three minutes then this will become little more thick so we are going to wait for another two minutes then our soup will be ready so here my soup is ready after two to three minutes nice simmering and I can feel nice aroma over here and in the last you know just very little just you know if you want you can add little bit extra but very little of sugar to give little bit of that sweetness and that's it this is all done and just switch off the flame you know you can just check the consistency if you want little bit thick then you can add little bit extra of all purpose flour or you can reduce little bit of water quantity and you can make it little bit thick so whichever way you want dear friends you can just make your own version in the last we are going to add the cream when we serve also what you can do is just you can just drop little bit on top of it that's it this is all ready to serve so here our soup is all ready just serve it onto a soup bowl my cream was little bit thick so what you can do is you can just dilute little bit and then you can add so that you know you don't have any cream to be seen on top of it so you can just mix it nicely and this is done and now when you go to a restaurant when they serve this nice hot tomato soup they're going to give you either a nice noodles fried noodles or you know the bread which are nicely toasted so these are little bit you know bread pieces I have just toasted it in the last you can just put your little bit cream and then you can put this mint leaf on top of it this is all ready to serve your family members or your guest or whomever you want to serve it just boil the ingredients and make a nice simple tomato soup home style so let me enjoy this nice soup and you also wow this is perfect and this is superb please try this and you're going to enjoy it so dear friends see you in another session with some more recipes